Now to another first for the city of Houston. We first told you about this last week. Our city is going to be among the first in the country to experience 5G wireless technology. Verizon announcing that it is going to begin rolling out a residential network before the end of the year and then a mobile version next year. It's going to change how some people use their phones, but the impact stretches well beyond handheld devices to transportation, health care, and entertainment. Our Ryan Korsgaard takes a closer look at what you can expect from 5G. Nine rocket powers the Dragon spacecraft toward the International Space Station. In today's world, technology allows us to explore more, communicate instantly, conduct business, cook at sonic speed, travel farther, and get there more quickly. 1G brought us car phones and paging, 2G allowed us to text, 3G let us share snapshots of our lives, 4G brought us live video from our phones and faster speeds, but we found the limits, especially at a ball game when the crowds show up and the speeds slow down, or when you try to download the latest viral video of a cat. <laughs> this is what you get, the spinning wheel of death. Now get this, 5G, the fifth generation of wireless technology coming to Houston first. It could hit the gas pedal on the information superhighway. Way. This is going to be one of the first cities in the whole world that's going to get 5G. Verizon says its 5G system will roll out later this year. It's already undergoing testing in the city. Industry groups say that this technology could link everything. Robots, medical devices, industrial and agricultural devices. A technology trade group says 5G will offer speed more than 100 times faster than what we have today. We're probably two years ahead of the global standard. So what does 5G mean to you? Well, if you want to get your phone and download the latest Hollywood blockbuster, we're told you could do it in the fraction of a second instead of minutes. Minutes. Are you tired of driving? Let the car do it itself. We're told self-driving cars would be one step closer to reality. Will our current phones work? Uh, for 5G? No, absolutely not. Dr. Lin Zong is a computer science professor at Rice University. He says 5G will not replace 4G, but he says it will be a big upgrade. How big a step is this? I think this, think of the things we have gone through 4G, four generation already. It's about uh, a decade, a generation, right? Starting from 1980s till today. I think right now we're at the end of fourth generation. Right now, Rice tests a key piece of technology for 5G. This prototype is mounted right here on Rice Stadium. 4G was the time iPhone and Android, basically Apple and Google, seized the opportunity rise to dominance in the uh, mobile computing scenario. Um, 5G is a fresh start. Dr. Zong predicts a new world of gadgets, innovation and creation, a true game changer in communication. I do look forward to the next 10 years, our life is going to be very different. In the fast lane of the information superhighway, Ryan Korsgaard, KPRC Channel 2 News.